and my buddy Dave and I are just out Five Mile Lake again. I decided instead of doing um, an actual camping video this time, because we've been here quite a few times, it's our favorite spot to go, I figured uh, I'd just show you what's in my backpack. So hopefully the dogs don't talk too much. But uh, here we go. Alright, so first of all, my axe is on the outside. Um, I usually don't bring that one, I usually bring another one. And uh, then my uh, my saw would be on the outside as well. This is kind of a new addition. This is just a little uh, sit pad that I've added, which I'm, I should be sitting on right now, but I figured for the video I'd show you. Uh, the very first thing I take off is my stool. This is a Stansport folding stool. I'd sit on that, but it's going to put me too high for the camera. This is a Fall Raven Kajka 75 liter backpack. Um, when I get to camp, first thing to come out, and we've been here for a few minutes, but I wanted to show you the backpack, so we've gone for a swim and stuff first. But uh, first thing to come out is my sleep system, so that's my underquilt. There's my top quilt. This is my homemade underquilt, just because it's going to be so warm. And then I get into, usually, would be my... Uh, my hammock gear journey tarp. We're gonna go over the top of the hammock. I always carry a little bag of uh, cordage, just some extra stuff. Got a couple of Dyneema lines in there just in case a ridge line or uh, even a suspension goes. I'll leave that in. Next, side pocket. Got my toilet paper and my uh, wipes. I always bring a couple of carving knives. It's a spoon knife and a more off 120 my spatula, oil, some sunscreen. That whining you're hearing is the dogs going for uh, going for some sticks. That's my med kit. That's a one person uh, med kit. A little bit of bourbon. Uh, that's tick key, light, uh, extra matches just in case, toothpaste and toothbrush, along with some Tylenol, and usually I'll have some antihistamines. For whatever reason, my salt and pepper ends up in this side pouch. So that's it for that side pouch. The first side pouch was all, uh, sometimes I'll carry two tarps. In this case, I only had the one. Okay, the top of the bag, that's where I carry everything that has to be, you know, delicate, so any, um, any stuff related to the camera, like batteries. Hopefully that wind's not going to throw off my, my volume here. So batteries, uh, charging brick. There's a journal and my lighter. I have pipe, some tobacco, and then I carry a lens cleaner now, just because I find kind of need it when you're doing filming. Okay, so on the very, very top, there's a, uh, a pack cover. Now, to get into the bag, maybe I'll try to show you how it's oriented. So this one is completely zippers apart, the front anyway. Hopefully everything doesn't fall out when I do this. Okay, let's see if you can see that. Yeah. So in the very top, that's where my footwear goes, my Crocs for camp. I only just started bringing those, kind of helpful. Um, this is a uh, Gore-Tex jacket. The next thing down is my clothing bag. It's not even half full, it's not even quarter full. Um, in there, I've just got stuff that I'm gonna sleep in, an extra t-shirt and an extra pair of shorts, some random cordage. My water filter is usually on one of the outside packs, but today it, I had it inside. And I always have my Mora knife in there. That's my survival knife. Then down to my cook kit. So this is my big Primus pot. Typically I don't carry this, but honestly I just got back from a trip, a canoe trip, and I haven't, uh, I haven't unloaded the bag at all, so it's still in there. Inside this pot is my typical cook kit, which I usually see in all my videos. The dog bowl, because we got the dog with me. Got some food for the dog. There's her tent. Just realized I'm setting up in behind here. This is going to be a lot of work putting everything back in. So that's her tent. There's my wooden cup. My war bonnet 
Blackbird XLC hammock. Um, and inside here, actually, I've got a little bit of that food stuff. That's some bannock mix and my, my uh, spoon and fork. Usually that would be in the side pocket. I always carry uh, an emergency. This is for every young mac and cheese dehydrated meal. I just throw it in. It doesn't weigh anything. It doesn't take up anything in the pack. This is a uh, hammock chair that um, it's just a piece of fabric that you, you have to have a frame and you hang, hang it like a kind of like a hammock and it's a chair. And that's my camp pillow for inside the hammock. And finally, which I'm kind of glad that I did this now, there's my crush light. Not really a necessary item. And honestly, like I usually turn it on in the hammock and just leave it. Uh, I don't actually use it at night because I use my, my headlamp. Okay, uh, I actually have a water bladder in here. I'm not sure if you can see that. I had that for the canoe trip. There's an extra uh, line, usually to hang my pack from. There's a carabiner in there. Now, side pockets. On these mesh side pockets, I have my dryer lint, soaked in oil. That's for starting fire. I have methyl hydrate for my little alcohol stove if I choose to go that route. I always carry that just because it doesn't weigh anything. This is actually from the MRE I did last time, so I'm going to have a little snack. This is a small Bluetooth speaker, which I don't use a ton um, nowadays, but I have it in case, you know, you want to hook up to the phone and maybe listen to some tunes. Uh, okay, and this side right now, that's usually where I put snacks. This isn't the kind of trip we're on that I'm really going to have any snacks, like they're in a cooler. This mesh pocket, I always have sunscreen and bug spray. And then the final, and that's my hip belt. The final pocket is uh, an enclosed one, and I always keep my headlamp and a multi-tool in there. And I, since I started uh, backpacking and stuff, I think I've used this multi-tool twice. And it's usually to open cans. So I, I don't often have cans along, so it's kind of it's in there just in case, kind of a, an emergency survival tool. It's got a knife and everything else. On. Okay, so that's everything that's inside the the, uh, the backpack. Everything all in one nice disorderly pile that I now I'm going to take in the back to where our hammock spot's going to be set up.